Morning, this is Ty with a RV in Jackson, Tennessee. Today we're going to look at this 2023 Cougar 22 MLS luxury travel trailer. And when I say luxury, it is a luxury travel trailer. If you took the fifth wheel that Cougar makes and reduce it down to this particular chassis, you're going to end up with these finishes, this construction, all to match up to what that fifth wheel is, plus a couple of extras just for the travel trailers. All right, so we're going to get into this. We are under 5,800 pounds. We're at 26 feet, 10 inches. Even though this says 22, you're going to have to add that tongue length to our overall length. So 26 feet, 10 inches. In 2023 Cougar 22 MLS luxury travel trailer. This is one, if not the smallest floor plans that they make, but extremely popular. I believe it is almost perfect for a couple and you can definitely sleep one more depending on how you have this option uh, just at the start laminated sidewalls they're gonna be equivalent to what that fifth wheel is gonna be front window with the new graphics that is an automotive glass painted fiberglass cap we have 30 pound tanks up front and you'll notice we have lithium already installed electric ton jack there's our three-year warranty reminder that is a structural warranty it comes from keystone and then on our roadside magnetic hold backs thicker doors a good amount of storage even with them having to cram as much stuff on the front side solar charge controller inverter prep Inverter's not installed. You can have that done ahead of time or option, but keep that in mind. We do have a motion light up front. And then this little guy that a lot of people don't know is our tank heaters, our 12 volt tank heaters. You'll see that our interior space is kind of broken up by this because you do have an onboard, on-demand hot water heater. That is something with the 23s that should be a standard all our connections are going to be in this docking station. Hot cold for your pressure shower. Zamp charge port if you need anything additional, but it does come with solar already on top. Cable slide, Keystone is going to that more and more and more. It's just more reliable. You can tell this is a shallow slide right over our double axle. We are going to have Goodyear Endurance e ready tires shot of that enclosed underbelly so fully enclosed and heated for those looking for something smaller that you can winter camp this is an option for you and you're not sacrificing anything for that 30 amp connection because it's a single ac but when we get inside this unit you'll see why that is more than enough walkable roof Nice vault to that roof, full bumper and spares included, LED lights around, and then getting back to our campsite. Look how far out that awning is going to extend left and right. So the full length, just about, of that. On this particular unit, we do have electric stabilization. Some of these units are optioned for auto level. So just like a fifth wheel, you can have auto level in a travel trailer for those that want ease of use and the convenience of outdoor speakers, key TV, one of the exclusives for Keystone with a connection for 110. Now, our windows, things like that. Ask your sales consultant about how these are constructed. All of that is getting better and better over time. Again, solar on top, slam latches, stable stairs. Those are Lippert solid steps. And then you're gonna notice our in-command system here too. They've moved our panel so you can see our hot water heater there. This is an aluminum substructure with white foam in the walls. Nice rainy day for me to be nice and wet while we do this and talk about this. So another shot of the profile, you're going to tell at the top there too, they've changed out the cover on that AC to be white, and that is on purpose this year, reduces that heat. Wine guard right next to it, 
and then our fan. So let's get inside. So stepping up, we are in the 2023 Cougar 22 MLS. Climate guard package, solar on top. Those come standard now. Right at the front. You're gonna have a wardrobe and a nice wide bed. Cougars normally have options for kings. So definitely ask about that. Check it and see how big that particular mattress happens to be. There is storage under that mattress. There is a privacy curtain and then spinning around. Theater seating on the slide. Our kitchen coming toward the rear. In this case, there is a dinette. You can option for table and chairs. The table would be almost identical as far as floating. TV above, our in command system there to the left with the hot water controls. And then our upgraded AC, which is a Keystone product. I talk about this a lot, but that takes a residential 12 inch filter. All your connections inside this AC are plastic jointed. You're not going to have crumpling down the road. Plus these diffusers, definitely look that up. Good amount of storage in this unit. And we have wooden front cabinetry. So you see the full depth of that plus storage under the dinette plus storage around the TV, and that TV is on a swivel, you can pull it out and look at it from the bed, plus storage under the bed and around the bed. All of our finishes again are the same as what a fifth wheel would be from Cougar. So all our side balances are identical. Kitchen at the rear. 12 volt fridge. I love a 12 volt fridge. You end up with more space, cleaner look, easier to maintenance and contend with. We're going to have small features like this, let you know that the gas is on. Three burner stove combo and a decent amount of counter space for a unit this big, too, especially considering you have a large double residential style sink with a pull down. Most are not going to have these or they're going to be a little bit more gimmicky. I hate to say gimmicky, but in a lot of cases it's kind of the way it is. We do have space for our waste can and additional storage at the top just to kind of max this out. For those that are looking for a view too, that would be roadside and rear. Now getting over to the bathroom. Bathroom's a little tighter because they max out that kitchen, so that's your sacrifice. But the shower is a good size, sliding glass doors, and with the vault at that skylight, pretty good height. I'd say up to about 6'4", no problem. But I have not measured that. Good amount of vanity space and a ceramic foot flush. They did go ahead this year and include a towel rack. Nice when they do those things. Still wood front cabinetry here. The only thing I'd say they need to upgrade or you would want to upgrade is put a max air fan here. There's two fans in the unit, but definitely upgrade that to a max air fan. A good amount of space considering it's splitting the rear here. We have lighted switches throughout. Thankfully with this one having lithium already on board, I can turn the lights on for you guys. Another thing to keep in mind with a Cougar travel trailer, the floor that we're seeing is called a hyperdeck. It does not have any wood in this floor. So currently, obviously the cabinetry in your trim is gonna be wood. We have a little bit of wood in the roof, so some of our truss structure is wooden. And we have a little bit 
Little bit of wood behind this lamination outside, but nothing in the floor, which is where water is going to run. And that is the thought process behind them developing that product. I expect fifth wheels to have it pretty soon and it's kind of work its way around Keystone. The Keystone constantly does things Keystone's way and they're putting a lot of money into R&D. So our Cougar 22 MLS 2023 model. So we have lithium on board. We have tank heaters. Mm -hmm. We have heated underbelly and enclosed automotive mm -hmm. front glass, that fiberglass cap too. The same roof membrane. The same lamination on the outside is what you're going to have in a fifth wheel. The same trim on the inside is what you're going to have in a fifth wheel. The same theater seats, the same just about as much as they can do. So all this stuff that comes with this unit and only at 26 feet 10 inches and under 5,800 pounds considering how much is crammed into this is kind of wild. If I dug even deeper, we can talk about things that are even more Keystone exclusive and that make this really stand out. If you get into one of these, you're gonna notice immediately it versus a lot of other travel trailers, the fit and finish is a lot better and they're gonna really compete with a lot of brands that won't try to call themselves a luxury travel trailer. So let me know what you think on this. I appreciate anybody that's watching. Give me a like, give me a subscribe. Definitely give me a comment. I always like to learn and see what people think and what they kind of hit on. But definitely give me a subscribe too. Thanks for watching. See you guys.